How's it going, everybody? Dave once again. Um, got this background thing. This is actually something I painted, but when the, my hand's not in there, it looks like a really big thing. But it's just something I started working on. But today I want to do a unboxing and product demonstration of sorts. Bought this lens kit. It's actually more of a filter kit online through Amazon. And went through what they sent us first was a lens cleaning pen back up so you can see it. it has a little thing that sprays stuff on there and it has a little cloth and stuff so to clean your lenses because i'm always getting fingerprints all over my lenses and it's just ridiculous and then they send you this little blue sorry it's a package in there get that out of the way it's a little blue microfiber real soft little cloth from butter is it butterfly photography or something like that? Anyways, I've bought stuff. My other lens came with one of these things too. They work really good for just kind of lightly dusting all the smudges and stuff that just day-to-day -day use of your cameras get. Also good for phones too. Little camera on the phone. You'd be surprised all the lint and stuff. You try filming stuff. Groups of people and stuff, not too bad when you start zooming in on stuff right away. It's... Yeah, you can really see the everything there. So anyways, there's a little thing. And there's the lens cleaner. It's a brush. It's a little pen. Like I said, it's good for digital cameras. I'm trying to get the autofocus to work there. Camcorders. Blackberries. Do people even still use Blackberries anymore? iPod. MP3 player. So, you know, sometimes your MP3 player will get smudges on the screen. And this is really the main thing that I bought, but those other things that came with it were just bonuses. This is the Vivitar Series 1. There we go. Focus is working good. It comes with these three little filters. It's a UV filter, a circular polarizer filter, fluorescent filter, and then a wallet. I was just excited to get this, but those other things are a nice bonus. So you can see on the back, it kind of shows... Kind of what the filters do. Like the UV filter. Mostly it protects your lenses from scratches, but it gives a sharper contrast when you're filming outside, which is nice. The circular polarization um, increases the color saturation. And I think those two, the circular polar filter and the UV protective filter, I think that'll really do a good job on cutting out on a lot of the, I guess you'd call them solar flares, the little dots that you see when I move the camera a certain way. You see all these lights lining up and everything being kind of like ghosted or something. And then the other thing, the FLD, it's a fluorescent filter. Um, supposedly it's supposed to give you like daylight, when, because sometimes when you're filming under fluorescence, things are a little darker. And that kind of helps them pop more. So that's kind of cool. You know, just one of the little tips of the trade. Open this thing up. It's made by Vivitar. We make it easy. Okay. thought that was somebody else's slogan. Toyota or Nissan or Honda or something. But anyways, pulling this out of the bag. Check that out. It comes in this really nice little padded wallet. Velcro enclosure, and you have these little net pockets, and then there's one of the lenses, let me take it out here for you, Oops. hard doing this one-handed, so, there we go, okay, that one has kind of like a yellow, I don't know what you'd call it, kind of a grayish tint to it, and this one is... The UV. It's 43 millimeters. Fits a lot of camcorders. Throw that away. Sorry about the crinkling of the plastic. Here's the other one. This is the CPL. It kind of has a yellow tint. <laughs> oh, I apologize for that. My allergies are still going and that's kind of cool the purple one that's for fluorescence making it look like daylight and again it has the little cheat sheet i don't know if you call it a cheat sheet or just a little handy guide for showing you 
I'm going to apologize doing this one-handed here. Um, yeah, it shows the filter kit. Again, a little bit more of what it does. Yeah, UV, circular polar, and then the fluorescent. So that's pretty cool. I know this one here kind of has like a little bit of a gray tint to it, as you can see. Um, and I bought it for this. It's my uh, son's headlight motorcycle project thing he's working on. So anyways, um, this right here, it just unscrews. Again, this is a Vivitar lens on my Canon Vixia camera. And this thing just unscrews like so. And there we go. That's the wide angle lens plus the macro plus a little adapter. And you're like, dude, wait, that's like way bigger than that. How's that going to fit? That's crazy. How's it going to fit? They sent you the wrong one. No, it's actually all right. I, th I thought that when I first opened it up, but not so much. There's the camera. Look at that. Woo. Sometimes this thing gets shy. Oh. It disappeared. There it is. All right. Enough of that. Anyways, what's cool about this is it just, if you have it on the right way, it just, you know, I'm really good about trying to get things to screw on properly and I strip stuff out. So I'm being extremely careful with that. There we go. That looks pretty good. And you can see that's on there. Now I got to clean that to get the fingerprints off, but. I'll show you what this looks like. And then what's cool is you can actually stack up these filters because this is threaded here too. But, in, uh, but instead what I'll do is I'll just screw this back on like so. Yeah, easier said than done. Again, this one-handed thing doesn't work. But you just screw it on. I'll just hold it in place. It's actually threaded. See right there, you can see the threads. That threads in. And what's pretty cool is this will screw into there so you can use the filters. A lot of times I've seen filters going on the outside. That's my desk cover on the outside. So you can use these filters. You can stack them all up. You can do whatever you need to. They'll protect the lens, keep it clean. But yeah, that's it. It's pretty cool. I'm looking inside it. I'm looking. I'm excited to get this out and try to use it sometime soon. So until then, until next time, see you later.